say N26. <laughs> Down my boy Snow Black. Never seen him play. <laughs> so Nibble is a uh, oh, um, a Michigan homie who uh, moved to Florida. Uh, probably, probably over a year ago now, honestly. But Nibble, if you're watching, shout out to you, dog. I know you do, you're doing nice stuff in Florida. Uh, Nibble, of course, younger brother of Nam, uh, who came out oh. to the MSU Weekly a couple weeks ago. Got to see him at a uh, Frostbite. Oh yeah, Frostbite. He did. He did very well. He was the second highest Sheik play, like second highest placing Sheik, and the second highest placing Michigan player, just behind Zenodo. Mm. All right, and that rapid jab, ill advised from Snow Black. And now N26 is gonna get a nice little punish. Oh, oh. the forward smash gonna kill right there. Take it. That clash though. Unfavorable trade. <laughs> Extremely <laughs> unfavorable. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about that. <laughs> I say that was a great play from N26 and a, a very favorable trade deal. That's some Donald Trump negotiation skills right there. <laughs> the greatest, the greatest trade, trade deal, deal in the history, history of all time. All right, and gonna get a nice coverage right there from Snow Black yeah, just trying to rifle back and okay. find this KO, but she can struggle with that. We get the four oh. and the vanish show black. That's gonna take it. I wasn't that quite sure if it work. would take it. I'm yeah. guessing N26 could have jumped out of that, but he didn't, and it worked. So good stuff, Snow Black. Yeah. It works. Good read. I guess it's one of those plays where like you're not really getting anything else that's gonna get a KO, and if you just do your vanish downwards, you're not really gonna get punished. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of it's it's kind of safe and like you you have a massive upside like it's low risk high reward that up smash higher risk but a nice high reward getting nice damage here and the next one will do it I dare say it definitely should Wait, let's see if we can get anything off of this up there no trying to go for the up smash a little too greedy and now and he's now, gonna get that up smash that, off of that rapid jab you were right. rapid jab unsafe and that up smash killing right there. So pretty commanding for NG6. It looks like maybe your your uh, maybe your prediction will come to fruition. You, could, like you so cursed far. my man, Snow Black. Sorry, Snow Black. <laughs> Why'd you do that to him? He's gonna be like, oh. man, Provencher's the worst. Falco's like the coolest character in the game. So, <laughs> nah. <laughs> he does have the best up. He has the best up. taunt in the game. He plays Hacky Sack. How cool is that? Hands off my prey. No. Wait, which no, one is that one? I don't, I don't, I don't even look. I don't have the sound on on my Wii U. I listen to music when I play, mm -hmm. so. And now we're going to see the switch to Bayo. Snow Black is a co-main between Bayo and uh, Cheek. I don't know why I struggled to think about the character that was on the screen literally 30 seconds ago, but yeah, it is what it is. Uh, and there's been a lot of discussion, especially this week, about how to play against Bayo. Uh, and now we're gonna look to see how much uh, N26 has been paying attention. That was a bad spot to be in, Ooh. but it worked out. But this switch is definitely paying off in spades right now for Snow Black. It, gonna fail it, that which time though? If it looks like N26 knew how to deal with Sheik a lot better than Bayo. This That's gonna a be dead a kill. bird. Yep. Yeah, for sure. Yep, those smash tags are pretty powerful. They're just like they have a late teens uh, first active hitbox like. And there's a lot of lag on them. They but look really they cool. Hit. They also have low, low priority, which is which is not good. Like they are not good They're, smash attacks, but they she's given she was given a kit where she'd at least use them. Mm -hmm. Like if they have a lasting hitbox out during that, which time they'll, they'll just clank. That's why a lot of times you'll see the uh, Bayo either down tilt or jab if they can, or up tilt. Do some type of tilt to put them uh, into hit stun and then up smash because that's not gonna clank out. And now we got a witch time. Are you dead? Oh, oh just misses. missing! Man, just missing out. right there. There's a little miss space. Yep, absolutely. Or probably just some good DI. No, I think if he would have like, I think if he would have just was would have been back just a little tidy bit, he could have connected that up smash because I believe like it just barely missed, and that backer is gonna yeah. finish it off. Quick two stack coming out. Yeah, man, man Snow I'm Black coming have. back with a vengeance. Yep. Hey, you just wanted to prove me wrong this time. <laughs> Man, Snow Black firing back! Snow Black firing back! <laughs> yeah, that was some pretty clean bay in that play. 
Oh, oh NG6, we're actually going to see the play. Rosa come out. We saw the Rosa, I think, for the first time in a long time, in the, uh, two weeks ago. I keep wanting to say it last week, but last week the weather was awful and I didn't come to the weekly. Mm. I was over at Frostbite by Friday. I know. You know. A lot of you guys went out Friday. You got the full got the full Frostbite experience, mm -hmm. uh, but no Frostbite here. But we are seeing lots of Bayonetta coming out in this set. And now Snow Black just kind of racking on a nice little bit of damage. Nothing too crazy. N26 struggling to find any hits at all. Can't quite this get in. This is kind of an awkward spot for uh, N26. Like he's, he seems maybe just a little lost as to what to do in the neutral and carrying that Luma up and getting it to pop. So I was listening to a set earlier today. Uh, it was Esam versus Crazy Colors. Mm -hmm. And one of the commentators said that Nabuzz said, as long as you're killing Luma, at least once a minute, you're in pretty good shape. Uh, we saw a 30 second Luma kill. So I think if we can look to see uh, Snow Black stay on that pace, having Luma gone is such a huge asset. Uh oh, yeah. we got a witch time. Oh, just missing, missing once again. again. And this is where you can tell that this Bayo is a little newer and not quite as polished. Yeah, just sometimes. because you have those moments like that. Sometimes you just have to go for some true stuff off of Witch Time instead of a kill. Yeah, I think it, even then it was a little bit early percents too. Oh, gonna get the grab! And now we got NG6 trapping him at this ledge with that forward smash not working like it did in game one. So it has been a while since we've seen this Luma get killed. Uh, now we got some tether play. The tether play actually working out pretty well. It's fairly uncommon. I know Fallen is probably the, the marquee tether Rosalina and Luma player, uh, but he's kind of went away from that style as he's uh, gained a little bit more proficiency and he started traveling a little bit more, becoming more nationally ranked. So mm -hmm. it's definitely, at least in the pro scene, the weaker way to play this character with playing with that far tether. Yeah, definitely keeping Luma up near but you. But these two are darn near dead even. It looks like N26 has kind of gotten a feel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, Battle. you're dead. Right. You are dead. Not too close. Yep. See, right there, but use that down tilt to pop them up. Make sure that there was no lingering hitboxes coming out. Right. Uh, so no opportunity for like, But the rock force Straight finish. back. You're going to get them. Yeah. Very nice read mm. from N26. That's what I mean when he's in your brain. Like, sometimes he just knows the buttons you're going to push before you push them. It's ridiculous. Right. See a juggle coming out here. That's so dangerous because when Luma, Rosalina and Luma are off that high, you are in a very bad way. Uh oh, another witch time coming out. Snow Black, he, uh, he's only missed one or two witch times. He's only whipped just a couple of them. For me or for Brovancher? That's fine. I didn't know. That's a good question. All right, let's get back into this match here. Still and very yeah, even. Yeah, very even. Uh, Snow Black stopped approaching, and N26 is letting his little yeah, little very, red demon try to approach for him. But he needs to recall his little red demon. Yeah, very suspect. <laughs> oh, the grab release. That was smart. And oh. the double hit of the down air. Had that been reversed, had the, the Rosa one been first, I don't know if it would have connected, but it definitely would have KO'd. Uh-oh. Oh, going to get out immediately. But going to drop the leg, and that's going to KO. Down air take it. That, is, that might be the 